happening. Veronica, good morning. Hey, good morning, Mark. We'll take a look at this dog. This is one of the many that are inside the pack clinic with a cast around one of its legs. Now, in total, as of yesterday afternoon, pack had eight dogs in the intensive care unit who were recovering from a broken leg. One dog in particular recovering from an amputation. Now, eight hurt dogs may not seem like a big amount, but pack officials say this is more than they typically see, and they're still trying to pinpoint the exact reason for the increase that they say they see in December and January. We tend to see a lot of animals hit by cars and um, it could be, you know, people are visiting and strangers are in the home and the pets are getting out, people who don't know the pet's behavior, so they're opening doors that they're not supposed to where the pets are. So there's a different number of reasons that could be adding to that cause. And along with those injured dogs in the ICU, there are more who are in different stages of their recovery on the actual adoption floor. Now, pack officials say they're working hard to get those dogs on the adoption floor who are still working on that recovery. They're working to get them homes as fast as possible so they can rest up and finish that recovery in a nice, quiet place. Mark Whitney. All right, Veronica, thanks.